But just recently, I lost someone close to me. And I know we all go through this, and the older I get, the more people I, I lose to death. And we had a celebration of life on Sunday. And this was my aunt. My aunt was really um, she was like a mother figure to me when I was younger. And I just love the celebration we had uh, this last Sunday. And my uncle gets up and they had been married for over 50 some years. And he talked about the fact when they had their 50th wedding anniversary, they took everybody on a cruise. And, uh, and when they were at dinner, someone said, anybody celebrating any, anything special? And Dale said, yeah, 50 years of marriage. And so the gentleman asked, well, what's the secret? What advice would you give? And Dale gave some flip answer and Kathy gave some you know, fun answer. And, you know, of course, here we are celebrating Kathy's life. And he said, you know what? The answer was one thing, love. And boy, isn't that the truth? Just love. I mean, love transcends everything. Love is a cure for everything. Love makes us feel amazing. Love does break our hearts. And so each day, you know, I've tried to just live a life full of love in my heart uh, and also just gratitude. Not gratitude for things, I mean, I, gratitude for things, but just a consciousness of gratitude. I think it's the biggest thing because when you feel gratitude just for the awe of being here, love and all those other great things just tend to happen. But anyways, I thought it was such a great answer, such an obvious answer. And do you have love in your heart? And are you showing it? And are you feeling it? And are you working on it? And think about any of those past relationships. Be the one to make the move because you feel more love, it's overrunning. I was at a wedding in the jungle uh, in January and the mother of the groom said, she was crying, she goes, my heart is so full of love, my eyes are overflowing. My heart is with all of you. Have a great day.